Hi friends, welcome to the Modern Learning. Today we are going to learn how to write an informal letter. So let's get started. There are broadly two types of letters, formal letters and informal letters. In today's video, we are going to learn the informal letter writing. Let's see what are informal letters. These are personal letters. They don't need to follow any set pattern or stick to any formalities. They contain personal information or are a written conversation. Informal letters are generally written to friends, acquaintances or relatives. Let's talk about the format of informal letters. As we mentioned earlier, there is no set format when writing an informal letter. But there is a general pattern that people usually follow. Let's look at this pattern and certain tips on how to write effective and attractive informal letters. Address Yes, the first thing to write is your address. That is, the address of the writer. We usually write the address on the left hand side of the page at the very top. The address should be accurate and complete. Even when writing to close friends or relatives, the address must be written so they can reply back to the letter. Date Next just below the address, we write the date. This allows the reader to have a reference as to when the letter was written. He or she can then relate better to the contents of the letter. A next part is the greeting. If it is a friend or someone close to your age, you can greet them by their first name, like Dear John. If you are writing to your relative like your mother, father, aunt or uncle, etc. You may greet them as such. For example, dear mom, dear dad, dear aunt or dear uncle. And if you are writing to an elder person, someone you respect greatly, you can address them as Mr. or Mrs. Then comes introduction paragraph. The introductory paragraph sets the tone for the whole letter. It should begin with a polite and friendly greeting or questions. You might begin by asking the recipient about their well-being. For example, how are you? I hope you are well. I hope you had a good time. Did you enjoy? The opening of informal letters should be casual and comforting. It must not be formal and direct as in formal letters. Then comes the body of the letter. In this paragraph, you tell the main reason to write the letter and share all the necessary details. You have to adjust the language and the words according to who you are writing to. With a friend, you can afford to be very casual, but if you are writing to an elder relative, you must be extremely respectful. Next comes the conclusion. In the conclusive paragraph, sum up the reason for writing the letter. That is, summarize the letter. Say a meaningful and affectionate goodbye to the reader. Do not forget to invite the reader to write back or reply to your letter. It shows an intention to keep the conversation going. Then comes the signature. There is no one way to sign off informal letters. Since they do not follow a strict format, you may sign off as you like. Some commonly used phrases are 
lots of love your friend best wishes kind regards or yours truly pick the one that best suits the occasion and then simply sign your name below the signature let's check out the format of the letter you need to write your address on the left hand side of the page then comes the date then the greeting for example dear friend then comes the introductory paragraph and the main body remember that the letter should begin with a polite and a friendly greeting or questions then comes the conclusion in the conclusive paragraph and after that the signature for example with love and under that comes your name Let's check out a sample letter which will help you to write an informal letter on the subject how you spend your time in the lockdown. So let's write this letter to a friend. So starting up with the address. So here we go. 123 Donut Street, Good Avenue, Unit 9, Enormous Apartment, California, USA. Then comes the date. Mention the date on which you are writing the letter. Then the greeting, like, dear friend. Then starting up with the introduction paragraph, like, I hope all is well at your place. Hope you are home quarantined and are spending quality time with your family. I guess it might be a little boring, but health should always be taken care of. I'm sure you are well sanitized and are following all the declarations of the government. Then in the next paragraph, share your experience of the lockdown, like, if you ask about me, I'm all fine. I've started pursuing my hobbies and have started exploring myself. All the board games have started coming out of the boxes and are now being played with. I've also started understanding how kind my sister is. It's been a long time of this lockdown. I just await of the day when we will be out of our homes doing whatever we wish to do. Then friends comes the conclusive paragraph like, looking forward to read, how are you spending your time during the lockdown? Stay home and stay safe. And at the end, you need to sign off. You can choose any signature mentioned earlier and under the signature write your name for example your friend john so friends this is the format of an informal letter after following this pattern you will be able to write an attractive informal letter so friends i hope that this video will help you to write an informal letter with the correct pattern if you like the video just give a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. See ya.